In this video, we will be renaming mixed numbers. You guys may not have known this, but every whole number can be written as a mixed number. So I'm going to show you that now. If I have four holes, so this is telling me, this big number tells me I have four holes. So if I draw four holes, and I'm going to put four pieces in each of these holes. These aren't my most perfect pictures, but you guys get the point. Four pieces with four holes. And then I'm going to go through and shade because we have four holes. So this one's all shaded. This one's all shaded. This one's all shaded. And this one's all shaded. This picture shows us four holes. What I can do is I can break this apart and I can say that four holes is the same as three holes and the fraction four fourths. And this is true because three plus another hole is four. So three plus this hole is four. So another name for four could be three and seven sevenths because we have three and the fraction seven sevenths with this, which is worth one. So this would be equal to four as well. I could say three and ten tenths because we have a whole and then a whole fraction. Sorry, we have three holes and a whole fraction, which would be four. In your notebook, write down a couple other ways we could write four as a mixed number. Here's three ways for you right here. Come up with a couple more. So here's video question number one. Answer this in your notebook and you'll enter it on your Google form after. It says, how can we rename the whole number eight as a mixed number? So how can we rename the whole number eight as a mixed number? Same thing we did over here with the four.